Hey everybody, Eric from Live Aquaria. Welcome to another episode of Divers Den Deep Dive. Today I'm here to tell you about the Tessalata moray eel. The Tessalata eel, also known as the honeycomb moray eel, has a light colored body which is patterned with attractive dark honeycomb markings providing a striking contrast making the Tessalata very alluring to hobbyists who fancy morays or large marine predators. While a popular eel, the Tessalata eel is not for everyone due to its potential size of 5 feet or more. These impressive eels require a large aquarium with a secure tight fitting lid that should be weighed down to keep these muscular eels from pushing their way out of the aquarium. Be sure to provide plenty of rock work that will act as structure for the moray eel to retreat into. Arrange the rock to create a cave or den for the eel to reside during the daytime. Morays are more active at night and will explore every inch of your aquarium when the lights are out, hence the need for a tight fitting aquarium cover. Since tessalatas are highly predatory with a large potential size, be sure any tank mates are much larger than the eel. Possible tank mates include triggers, puffers, groupers, and even damsels which are usually too quick for the eels to catch. Like all morays, tessalata eels are very hardy and will readily accept meaty foods such as shrimp, squid, scallops, silver sides, and other prepared marine predator diets. When feeding tessalata eels, you can use feeding tongs or a long feeding stick to hold or spear the food. Then place it in the proximity of the eel for it to consume. For this feeding of frozen thawed silver sides, I'm using a pair of Marlin 24 inch forceps which are available on the Live Aquaria website. Be sure not to hand feed any moray eels since their eyesight is not the best and your fingers can easily be mistaken for food. More importantly, moray eels have seriously long and sharp needle-like teeth that ensure their prey cannot escape its mouth once caught. A bite from any medium to large size moray eel would more than likely result in serious damage to human flesh in a trip to the emergency room. While tessalata eels may not be for everyone due to their large size and large aquarium needs when full grown, they can be an impressive spectacle and rewarding display animal since some consider larger eels pet-like. We offer Tessalata Moray eels on the regular Live Aquaria site and also on the Divers Den page when they are available. Thanks for watching today's episode of Divers Den Deep Dive, Tessalata Eel. Until next time, feed, siphon, repeat.